Good evening, I'm David Merrill and this is your News Brief. According to Comscore, Yahoo surpassed Google as the top web property in the U.S. last month. It was the first time Yahoo had topped Google since May of 2011. Yahoo and its various sites garnered 196.6 million unique views in July. These numbers did not take into account traffic from Tumblr, which Yahoo acquired earlier this year. Though Yahoo and Google have been close in these rankings for some time, and the numbers tend to shift from month to month, drawing the top spot is considered a big win for Yahoo CEO Marissa Mayer. In entertainment news, Ben Affleck has been cast in the role of Batman in the upcoming Superman sequel. Affleck is currently enjoying a strong run as both an actor and director, with his most recent success being the Academy Award winning Argo. Fan reaction on the web has not been positive in the first few hours since the announcement. Many were not fond of Affleck's attempt at Daredevil. In the aftermath of that film, Affleck inferred that he would not be playing a superhero again. However, the chance to play the caped crusader was apparently too strong to pass up. In world news, the Jerusalem Post is reporting that a youth group in the Gaza Strip is planning on holding protests against Hamas, similar to the one started in Egypt against President Morsi. The grassroots group says it will not use violence and spoke out against the repression and tyranny of Hamas, calling the organization medieval gangsters. Hamas blamed its chief rival, Fatah, for instigating the protest and has already begun to crack down on the movement. Stocks bounced back today after a down day yesterday. The Dow Jones gained 66 points to settle at 14,963. The Nasdaq climbed 38 points to close at 36.38. And the S&P 500 increased 14 points to finish at 16.56. Those are your headlines for the day. For more news, visit NorthMobilePost.com. And if you like these videos, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe.